My name is Celia Naid. Uh, I'm from Lebanon and I'm doing my master's in petroleum engineering. I have a cousin who's older than me by three years and she did her undergraduate in geology and uh, she made me interested in that field because whenever we used to go around field trips around Lebanon and everywhere she started talking about the geology and everything how it's formed and it really made me interested in that subject so I decided to go for it. One of the most interesting things that we do on our course is that the professors provide us with real data from around the world so that we can use them and uh, learn new software so that we can input them and uh, work on them and it's really nice not just to have the theory part of the course but also to practice it. My parents are actually very supportive because uh, they both come from a scientific background. My dad did uh, studied physics and my mom studied chemistry so and I really excelled in scientific subjects at school so they wanted me to do something I excel in. I do believe that more women should go into STEM courses because uh, what I've seen and from my experience uh, even though some women like, would like to go into STEM subjects, they are discouraged. Like uh, Some people tell them that they can't and it's hard and it's more for males, so they don't go into it. But I do believe that if it's something that some, like, some, anyone wants to do, they should go into it. My goal is eventually to go back to Lebanon and work in the oil and gas industry. But for now, I'm applying for a PhD. I would like to continue my studies, academic studies in petroleum engineering. Uh, so that I can go back to my home country and input what I've learned. I think that if someone tells you you can't do something and you believe you can put your time and effort into it and achieve in it, don't let anyone stop you from doing what you, what you really want to do.